Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for September the 12th of 2020, well, it is titled A Thousand Meteors. So what do we see here? Well, this is a time-lapse video that will run a little over a minute as you play it, and it goes back to t April of 2019, and from the clear nights between then and when this video was made, 372 clear nights were put together and showing the little clip of the different meteors that happened to be caught in these images. So it's a whole bunch of images over the course of the year. Now, if you note the landscape in the foreground, you'll see that that stays the same. So it will remain unchanged, and we're looking at the same point at the sky and the same positioning, and then you'll be able to watch over the course of the image how this, how everything changes and the constellations that will change and appear. So as you play the video, you will see that it starts out and will begin to uh, start with the, uh, the sky and you'll be able to see various different meteors that show up. Some of them are grouped together and are traveling the same direction and others are uh, coming in random directions. They're called sporadic meteors. We'll see the Milky Way pass across the central portion of the image uh, over the course of this time. And again, still seeing all of those different meteors. Now, meteors are just a small bit of a comet or asteroid that was left behind in the orbit. And when the Earth happens to pass through that orbit, they hit the Earth's atmosphere and strike it and vaporize at extremely high speeds. So we're seeing those meteors vaporizing. And that's what forms the great trails that we see of the meteors as we work our way through this image. And as we continue onward and come towards the end, you can actually see the Orion there as we get to about the one minute mark. Orion is off to the left. This is south of the equator, so note that Orion will be upside down from what those of us in the northern hemisphere are used to looking at. And then now the Orion has disappeared. The Milky Way is long gone off the image, but we're still seeing various meteors from various times of day. Uh, various times in the night that were taken uh, during these images. So all those little bits of material that have been left behind, we often see them as a meteor shower associated with the material left behind by a comet as it orbits, but they can also be other little bits of material or debris that the Earth's atmosphere happens to pick up. And when they strike the Earth's atmosphere at very, in very high speeds, they will simply vaporize. So these are all small particles that never make it down to the surface of the Earth because our Earth protects us. Uh, our Earth's atmosphere will protect us from them and then allows us to see a, the show of a meteor burning up and streaking across the sky. So that was our picture of the day for September the 12th of 2020. It was titled A Thousand Meteors. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture, previewed to be bigger than a butterfly. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day, everyone, and I will see you in class.